Good morning, Birdie. Good morning. Good morning. I used to have a friend named Birdie. Not that Birdie. But that Birdie was another kind of Birdie. You know what I'm saying? That Birdie, their name was Birdie, but they were like a bit bird brain. But anyway, good morning. I forgot. I forget sometimes that I gave myself a job. Good morning. Fort Bragg. Pope Air Force Base and all things in between. You know what I mean. Anyway, uh, drinking La Blue, La Blue, La Blue water. Clean water when you get up in the morning. This is not a narrative. This is just a fact. When you get up in the morning, you need to hydrate yourself like that because you have been fasting or should have. Now, if you were like me last night, yesterday was like a very interesting day and I found myself just eating up everything. I cooked pusketti. I, cooked <laughs> I know spaghetti, but I like saying pusketti. You know, give me my vices or don't. I don't care. It doesn't have anything to do with you. I cooked it with my own money and my own, you know. And you know what? The attitude child. I'm thinking maybe I gave myself. Who gave me that name? Did I give myself that name? I don't know if I did. I don't know if someone gave me that name. People are always giving me these labels. And then, you know, I'm like, okay, whatever. But my attitude is a winning attitude. My attitude is a righteous attitude. Not necessarily a pious attitude. Because you have some people who are so pious in everything they do, appearance-wise. And then behind, you know, closed doors and unseen eyes, oh, they put the P in pious. You know what I'm saying? literally. So I'm not that type of pious, but I'm righteous with what I do. And I represent my mom and my dad. And, and we all know it's true right now that all parents aren't alike. Just like all people are, are not alike. Just like all people in the military are not alike. All cops are not alike. All soldiers are not alike. All black people, whatever you choose to name me, it's not alike. And it's the labeling for me. It's the labeling. Like, since we're speaking diversity, I still have a problem with every time black people have fought for something and literally fighting for our own rights ends up fighting for everyone's human rights. Yet, people take us out of the fight and then it's all about them. And you forget about what we did. Or maybe you never knew. And that's why you don't like teaching critical theory. Because critical theory might come back and put the finger back on you from the stuff that you still benefit from. And yes, you do. You really do. You may not think so. Well, I didn't have anything to do with my ancestors, my grandparents, or my parents. But you do, though. But you do, though, because we cannot walk away from our legacy like that. Like, I am fully in agreement with uh, what my mother and my father, the legacy my mother and father left for me and what they instilled in me. Now, some of you do not because you did not have a good agreement with your parents. Your parents, that was your journey. That wasn't mine. But I'm saying you're supposed to learn every time. So what have you learned from the lies that your parents told you? I'm telling you, right, because there were lies. And there's still some lies. That's why when people come up to me and they want to bring out that, you know, that stereotype and energy. What do you see when you see me? What would Jesus do, me? But you can't see it because I'm a little darky girl with uh, locks. Wait a minute. Hair like wool. Ooh. Feet like burnished bronze brass. Ooh. 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 That's in your books. That's in your books. Didn't look like that. That's not burnished bronze brass. Burnished bronze brass look like a copper penny. Who looks like a copper penny today? But bless believe. Bless believe and best believe I'm worth more than a penny. And these people tried to penny lane me since the day I came into their vicinity. They tried to use up all my energy for themselves. My name is still on everybody's top shelf. You're still making money off of my commercials. But I'm the one that you want to put the devil on. That's so wrong. You're so wrong. But today, Wednesday's Child is winning. Flavor and favor. Do you like what you see? Whoever, whoever happened to Samuel, I don't care. That's not me. But I'm just saying, it's energies like that. Black Music Month. June is Black Music Month. Where is the room for my diversity? Might I say June is Black Music Month without having some pride gangsters or transgender people come and try to come at me with some BS? Like, I won't slay their asses right to the ground. Very sound. Yes. When God goes down, it goes down. But not like you do. Hey, hey, do you, boo? Do you? But wait, can I do me? If I run, if I walk, if I play sports like a tomboy, then let me be a tomboy. Don't put a dyke label. Don't put a butch label. Don't put a... I mean, I'm saying this and you say this to yourselves. It's funny how people say things to themselves, but they don't want nobody else to say that. Just like, you know, the word nigga. 
Everybody can say that word again. Some of y'all got way too comfortable. And I really have, I have to admit, I made some of you a little bit too comfortable in saying that. But I bet you some of those people who say, who say it around you, they won't say it around me because they know exactly what I'll do. I'll sweat that taste out their mouth so fast. And I will do it in such a beautiful way because I'm a military brat and we do things differently. Okay, 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 okay. We're not like, you know, the Kardashians or the Smiths or any of those, you know, really strange shroomy kids. We're not like Kid Cudi going to cry up on the stage mm, and think we're going to hum our problems away. No, we're not going to take drugs and expect love from some dreams up in the sky. Although that CBD kicking in. Well, anyway. <laughs> Why, Val? Why do you do that? What am I doing? Everybody's looking for a quick fix. Here's a, here's a lesson for you. It ain't no quick fix. You got to do the work. Faith without works is dead. That's why you have a lot of deadheads leading churches, and churches do hurt us. Like the people who preach, 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 but they don't practice what they preach. So what are you teaching today? Are you teaching lies? Are you teaching how to slay creatively? Are you teaching how to throw hands and hide, you know, and, and then hide them? Or throw rocks and hide your hands behind your back? Are you going up against a military brat and found that that person smarter than you and now you don't know what to do so you decide you're going to get the whole community and gain stock on them? And could that be you, boo-boo? Could that be you? Don't do that. That's so distasteful. But you want to be the person that's got all the taste. <laughs> Yeah, we see what kind of taste you have now. That's a funny thing about math. When you keep doing bad math, it's going to show that it's bad math. Negativity, 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 negativity always leads to a liability and no productivity. Some of you who are in relationships like that and you're in businesses like that and you're in thought process like that because every factor you put in was a negative or a non-real factor. And what is real? They say real is objective, but I say real is very objective. Like tangible and intangible. You put a lot of tangible hopes into some intangibility matters. You put a lot of money into NFTs and Bitcoins. Now, rich people, so-called rich people, media rich people, lying rich people swore out that they did. That was the biggest scammer since... There's some names I could name, but never mind. And there's a whole bunch of them, okay? Don't just think it's just one or two or three or four. It's so many more. So many more. All around the world, I, I, I. Yeah, I see. And they see me. Be Speaking of which, my military family, I salute you. I love you like you love me. Shout out to my troops at Fort Bragg and Pope Air Force Base. We're going to continue to say that, okay? Because it's a legacy. And you can't destroy a legacy by just labeling something. Again, like I said, one of my favorite banks. I have two. And that's what I'm telling you. Make personal relationships with your bank. Do you have a personal relationship with your bank? See, it's hard to roll up in my banks and try to, you know, slide some credit fraud or some insurance fraud or even come in there. If you, if you steal my ID, my bankers know me. I do personal business with my money. I don't sleep with my money like that. That's what you do. But that's the problem for you is that you got a whole skewed view of what, you know, how you make money. I told you I don't make money. I, I don't make money on my back like that. You know, I'm 10 toes down on the ground because I roll like that. Military brats, we're like that. We're sound. Part peace hippie, part soldier warrior. Yeah, we'll fight for our rights. You best believe that. We won't lie for them. Unless we lie and try to hold back. <laughs> what we uh, There I go tapping again. Anyway, like I said, I have personal relationships with my banks. So whenever you try to put some stuff in there, they know my spending habits. They know when like, okay, you know, I'm going to go over this month because you know how it is. I got to pay for stuff, but you already know I got money coming in. So you're going to get that back. So we have a relationship with that. If you don't have a personal relationship with your bankers, I mean, we're in a system. So the system is going to always clap back when you try to tweak it. Although the system does need to be tweaked, but it needs to be 
tweaked by very smart business minded people, not just, you know, hoes and bros from the streets, because you're still going to bring in that gang mentality into a big systemology. And that system will collapse every time because you guys were blind. You thought you were going to whine and dine and F your way to the top. And somehow or another, you had to know all that shit was going to drop. You can't keep pulling and pulling and pulling and pulling and pulling and pulling. It's like trying to take all the farmland away and then give you fake food. And you wonder why you sit today. I got the doors open, I'm cleaning the house, you know, I got the windows open and stuff like that. So the little buggies come in. Everybody seems to want to be my friend. Everybody wants to come into my dominion. I am not being Miss Peregrine this year. So tell all your little nappy little children, and your, little, and, and your greasy head ones too, pass along, my dear. Auntie Val would not be giving out free water, and Auntie Val would not be helping you with your summer work. And Auntie Val don't care. Go to your parents. They get a check for that, which better not be mine. Don't play with me. I'm really not lying this time. Or with my family. Because you tried to play with my family. And I called them my family because they are the ones who looked out for me when nobody else would. Shout out to the people at MWR. Especially, never mind. But, uh, <laughs> my mind went somewhere. Huh. Okay, that part of me is not like, you know, it's still there. That's good to know. In case, you know. Anyway, don't mind. You know me. I'm doing Pisces things. So School Cafe, by the way, comes on this week. And uh, I'm like, really? I, I started doing the show like Sunday. And it's like, it's Wednesday. This is so me. And, uh, but the person's going to get it before it airs the bar. It's up to him whether he airs it or not. I don't care. I'm just going to do the show. And then I let it go. I did my part. I'm not paying for it. I'm paying for myself, yo. When you hear advertisers, I pay for that. When you hear sponsors, I pay for that. When you see who puts together those tracks, it's me. Nobody's doing that show but me. Don't let people think, oh, she's getting this person, this person. You see, I'm I'm here. I'm in my Ranger Main. Did I say it's Ranger Manger Show? It's Ranger Manger Show. So you can have all the equipment in the world. You can flash all this. But I learned this from one of the greatest, if not to me, the greatest production expert of all times, Mitch Faulkner. Mitch Faulkner, who showed me, because you don't know, when we were doing the Edge magazine, man, I know, right? We were doing some, we, we were, you're talking about some in rig stuff, <laughs> but we were getting it out because we had real talent. The talent wasn't in the things, the talent was in us. That's why I can say, you know, like, who who taught Mitch Faulkner? He taught, maybe, probably he taught himself, but there's some things that I even taught him. Because I was like really sharp with a knife or as far as like sounds and cutting it just right. When he would say like black, let it go. Like I can get it. I can get it. I get dogmatic on stuff that I know I can do this better. It's just that people who see that, they will end up hating you to the letter because they want to do their worst. They don't want you to do their best. Your best. Your sh as you've heard them all say or people say your shine irritates their demons. It does. So my shine irritates their demons. When I walk into a room, they know who you are. Elders told me that a long time ago in Atlanta. They see who you are, daughter. They told me that a long time ago when I did my poem, Shoot the Black Target, that I needed to have protection around me because my, my enemies always see me before I see them. Because I'm looking, I, I'm actually looking through eyes of love, and they're looking through eyes of jealousy. Let me tell you something. If you are the able, you have many canes. Many canes, not just one. And some of them are in your own family. You're sleeping with your cane right now. Or your cane is in your business. Or your cane is in your family. Or your cane is your boss. Or your cane is your, supposedly your best friend. Or your cane is somebody you've just been hanging out with who's been waiting to take you out and use you for a clout. I have a lot of people who are like that. If I was really as bad as they say they were, and like I, like I don't know where they live or can't find where they live. Like you can find me, I can find you too. So if I was really like you, I'd be all up in your stew. I am the type of chick that goes to knock on your door or kick that bitch in and say what? What'd you say about me? Yeah, I'm kind of that crazy, but I'm not that crazy because military brats don't react like that. Well, sometimes we do, but that's why I'm telling you, I'm here for your therapy because none of these people aren't going to really tell this to you because they want to make money off of you. Therapists need to make money too. Psychologists need to make money too. The system needs to make money too. So they need you as tools and fuel for their, you know, to live on. Doctors didn't get that push from healthy people. You know what I'm saying? They didn't send your kids to schools because of healthy people. So technically, the business of doctoring 
is to uh on the high vibing side it is to help you become well and a better you on the low vibing side it's to strictly make money off of you this country has been low vibing since a long time maybe for i don't know i'm just talking about 67 years in this timeline i've been here many times before that's why i'm able to uh like do this and not like die or maybe i've died many times i don't know maybe i died january 26 that was some havana syndrome shit Woo, man gosh lord anyway y'all gotta watch more history channel okay but those who know know what i'm talking about i know right like hmm, hmm, hmm. There I go, dropping intelligence again. Never mind. Remember, is this the end? Not necessarily. Unless you're not a friend to you. I'm going to see Shao winning. What am I to you? And why does it matter whether I win or whether I lose? And why would you want me to lose when I helped you? That's the part that I really had to get over. The people that I helped that so much wanted me dead. Not just passed over like dead, dead. Oh, you really came from my head. You really, really came from my head. What would a soldier do about that? What would Jesus do? Remind you, there are no J's. Please don't beat, 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 please don't beat, please don't beat people with your Bibles today. I'm going to say this in a nice way. Say Jesus till the cows come home if that works for you. But reminding you, it really is true. There were no J's. So who are you calling on? Who is Jesus? Okay. Maybe that's a good start for you today. To figure out who is Jesus to you. And embrace that spirit, not just a label. Because when you embrace that label, you're embracing all the lies that went with that label. And a lot of lies go under the label of Jesus. Scientology will do that. Scientology, by the way, I didn't know till South Park, because I mean, my husband and I were looking at that. I was never forget that. Like, they really believe that shit? And, and, and hubby was like, mm -hmm. no, no. Because have you ever watched South Park and Chef? Do you ever, under, you know, Chef, by the way, was Isaac Hayes. You youngins don't know what I'm talking about, okay, today. And, and, and Isaac, oh my gosh, by the time I get to Phoenix, that man, it's Black Music Month. It's Black Music Month. It's Black Music Month. Isaac Hayes. <sighs> mm. Mm. <laughs> Give me a minute. Mm. Mm. I don't need no bald headed chick. All right. No chick ain't gonna make me like come just because you look like as Isaac Hayes. I'm not the one. Go to somewhere else. That's that's their thing. That is not mine. I want a manly man, 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 like Isaac Hayes. I say that, okay, because people say they need to be clear. Well, what part of clear do you hear, my dear? I'm not bi. I'm not gay. I'm not a butch. I'm not a dyke. You say those things too, right? So I'm just saying, don't come at me with that BS fight. When you say that to yourself, but then when somebody puts that back off on you, well, I'm not that, then you want to come at me. You want to do that, like, you know, that shade, that shade thing, like, see, see, see. See, like you throw the rock first, and then when I retaliate, it's just like sports. The ref never sees the person through the, you know, who who started the fight. They always see the person that did that that retaliates, and then that's the person that gets the flag. So I get the flag from retaliating on some mofo who got me twisted. Bitch, I'm lifted and gifted. Just know that, okay? Just know at any time I could have shot you dead in a variety of ways, and I didn't. So that was the gift. You lived. Are you hear what I'm saying? And that's what makes them mad when you do it that way. And that's what I'm saying to my military brats. They don't know about us. They don't know that we don't, you know, we don't, we don't do jail. We we try our best not to do jail. So when you're coming up to me with the, it's the audacity for me. When you're coming up to me and saying you're special ops, da, 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 but you just got a prison for 20 years. Okay. Now that's possible, I guess. That's why, like, I, no offense, but Jersey folks, when you say Jersey, Philly, you know, California, Virgo, 
Pisces, Cancer. I mean, there's certain things. And I shouldn't group that in all because I've had some really good relationships with all signs. I've had some really bad relationships with a variety of... And, and especially when you see the patterns, it's like, okay, maybe I need to pull back that energy or maybe something else is going on around me. Why are all the Cancers in my life effed up? Why are all the Virgos in my life effed up but not all the Virgos? Because, you know, that power of three is real. I had the power of three around me the whole time. Time. It's funny how you can have that energy, the good energy. So, and and we discuss that, and it's like, oh wow. But it's in the same time, the other part will come through to you too. Like this movie, I'm a. Ver I don't want to see that because I'm like, no. But it looks like it could be a cool movie. But you know what? Because some some people will mess it up for everybody. Like some black people, unfortunately, don't 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 stereotype you have white people who mess it up for everybody you have black people who mess it up for everybody you have italian you have jews you have asians you have everybody who mess up for everybody so when you say i want to be in a world where all these kind of people it's still going to be jacked up because a lot of those people are effed up and if you don't believe that then you're the one that's effed up good luck with you i wish you well and your koresh click <laughs> and do whatever you do but you know what you ain't gonna do me uh so the blue, the blue, the blue. It's locally owned too. It is. Do you support the blue? But I bet you you'd support it, Dasani, like crazy, or everything else that comes on the shelves. And Dasani, and I'm not really knocking Coke. I understand the business, right? But why would you put salt and water? I know. But people don't care because they buy it anywhere. I'm just saying. You need to do your research. Like you do your research on the labels of food, you need to do your research on the labels of people too. June is Black Music Month. Before we get off into pride, where's my pride? Where's the pride for people like Isaac Hayes? Oh, I didn't finish the story about Scientology. So an alien, a, a, a alien found it your, uh, uh, you, you found it your stuff? Okay, I mean, like, have you ever, I mean, this is a challenge for you today. Fine, I, and I'm not knocking it, okay? Because it's a fascinating story, see? No. You know when you get too close. It's a fascinating story. Find out the beginnings of Scientology today. And then just, I guarantee you, you will go. And I'm not sure that all this Jesus loves us and Jesus for us. This either sounds like some Scientology or some Mormon sus stuff. And it might not be. You know who cared about everybody? Jesus. Remember Hillsong was Jesus too. Hillsong, Hillsong, what did you do? Hillsong, did you get Hillsong like I did? Hillsong found out that I was that kid. Hillsong found out that Jesus claps back. That rose can snap. That. Yeah, you got it. You saw it. And anyway, and Mormons too. Mormons, are you still saying black people can't get to heaven because of you? You. You're going to say black people can't get to heaven. You, of all people. Do we really need to get off into what you're really about? I mean, there's some good things about the Mormon faith. But there's some things that y'all clearly have not worked out. And the fact how you have the nerve to even not even correct that or still have that in your teaching somewhere about blacks don't go to heaven. Why? Where? Like Asians who think black people have tails. Stories that you sell very well, forgetting the fact that your uh, samurais and some of your Buddhas were blacker than me. See, I had those black statues in my house that my daddy and my mommy taught me until, you know, when you go into grief, things somehow disappear. So those statues ended up you know, somewhere, I don't know, not here. But at least I have that in my heart, like I have what my parents taught me. So no matter what my friends or family took from me, they couldn't take the legacy away, the treasure, because the treasure was in me. And that's why I'm telling you, the treasure is in you. So no matter what the system or the government or your community or whoever, you know, you're dealing with takes from you. You can start over again because the treasure is you. Don't give them your soul. See the agenda? June is Black Music Month. Black music talks about soul, not just hip-hop. And see, we do that to ourselves, too. That's why I said there's some Africans that like really make me hate Africans. Really. They really do.
boy. Why would I tip you? Over, maybe. <laughs> don't play with me like that. I told you, don't bring a mind to a mind foot party unless you got one. Trump you every time. Bow down, bitch. You know you lying. Anyway, <laughs> it's just me flexing today. Okay, where was I going with that? Just check into the labels of who the people say, whatever they say, before you get off into the other person, okay? Because you could find out that you will listen to a fool. And then you end up being the tool. Your destruction came through you because you listened to the wrong people. And you went up against the wrong chick. And daddy said, and mommy said, and hubby said, nah, that ain't it. I'm 67 years old and proving my walk every single day. Not just behind cards and a desk and in my bed and in my jammies, okay? I get out there and actually walk that walk. People can see me, touch me, feel me, but don't do that. Because I am choice property. Do not touch the hair. And do not touch until I say. If I extend my hand to you, fine, okay. But don't come rushing up to me. Because I've never liked that. Not even when I was in radio. Believe it or not, I mean, you know, I was very personable to everybody. But I'm just a personable chick. But it was people who taught me, you know what, you can't trust tricks. People have run up to you and want to get your energy. Because they got all this mess on them. And it's like, you know, they hug you and then they put that shit on you. And they may not even realize that they're doing it. Many times I don't think they do. Some really do know it. They want to. They they want to put that energy on you. Those are the ones. <laughs> Those are the ones. I'm pouring that 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 Saturn returns coming for you. Lessons. Is it a lesson or a blessing? It's both, my friend. It just depends on how you get it in. You say you're a chosen. Well, now you're going to have to prove it. It's that part though. You ain't gonna prove it. You know, you can tell the people who like you gotta you got you have never heard me say, you gotta like and subscribe, you gotta like and subscribe, you gotta like and subscribe, you gotta hit me on my cash app. It would be nice if some people gave back. It would be nice if some people even remotely gave a little bit back what I gave to them, but I don't expect that, okay? Because they're you know like they're the ones that should have been drowned. People make it. And then they come back and do the same shit. It's like addicts. You cannot trust an addict with a bag. Seriously. If you got an addict that's heading your company, no matter what it is, you are going to end up in a liability. Whether it's an addiction to drugs or, or, or money or hoes or bros or fame or whatever it is. If you don't have a balance in your ish, you're going to end up losing all your shit. That's your lesson for the day. It's, it's, just like that, I gave a free class. See why I call it philanthropy? But they want to make the demon out of me. What would Jesus do for me? But again, there are no J's. So before you beat people in the head with your Bible, okay, why don't you at least have the courage to step from around that loop, around that mountain that you have made? It was a molehill, but it's a mountain for you today. Because you're still walking around the same loop of lies. And you think that your spies are going to make you wise. Because you're peeping on somebody when you need to be working on yourself. This government is crumbling. With or without your help. So who's going to save you? Jesus? Maybe Jesus just did. Or maybe it was Jesus' kid. Or maybe it was none of the above. Maybe you look at me, you don't see love. What do you see? Reminding you, whatever you see, it's a projection that I'm reflecting you back to me. Back to you. You get it? Maybe you need to drink some coffee or better water. There are no J's, but there's definitely me. Have a good day. And you know what? I'll create a path for my diversity. No one wants to ride for me. I'll ride for myself.
The strong military black, the tomboy chick who knows how to fight back and clap back, but I will clap back in style. Like I said to my military brats, when, we, when they go low, we have a tendency sometimes, if you push us enough, we go lower. And again, we don't go to jail. We don't go to jail. We'll go to hell before we go to jail. Let's not do neither of that. Let's do better because we are better. We are the change they've been waiting for. And I guess since I gave myself a job. <laughs> Who gives himself a job? Not a whore. Mary wasn't a whore. That's another lie they told you in the Bible too. And there are some preachers who know that for a fact. That Mary Magdalene or a Mary want a groupie or her. The fact that you would take a queen's lineage like you always have done before and flip it to a whore, that's some faggot ass gay ass shit. Bim, bam, 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 King James. That's it. The book that you follow is so hollow because of who sanctioned the book. But you say it doesn't matter. God says it matters. Oh, God says it really matters. God is too. Mom and dad ain't playing with you. Not at all. But hey, I'm just telling my stories because that's what I do. You need a new storyteller, a real one. I'm not trying to beat up the kids or beat up the women or I'm not trying to be mad at all the men. I'm trying to, you know, I'm just doing me. If you wake up, you wake up. I don't give a fuck. I'm in my Pisces boat. Yo, surf's up for me. Be careful about these beaches. You're only digging a hole to China and, the, and those beaches are eroding. Mom's going to clap back. Those waves going to pull you out to sea. Reminding you, don't look at me. Jesus going to save me. People have done that. You've had kids go out there on the surfboard at Cure Beach with that same energy. I'm talking to some people who preach that go, go, go. And then they went out there thinking they could do anything, you know, because y'all are gods and we can do this. But when the surf's high, the smart ones know that's how we end up getting old. Like me and the old soldier who talked about it last time I was there. Like, you know, we just saw this family the day before and now the next day one of the soldiers, one of their members is not here, young kids, because the kid went out on the surf. When all the signs were like, no, no, the adults know. When you start seeing adults, when you go to the beach, and it's not, some people really just don't like the water, but some of us love the water. We grew up on it. But So when you see us like sitting back or don't going out, you know, in the waves like that, whether it's Cape Fear River or Cure Beach, I mean, I don't go to Atlanta and Carolina Beach, you know, I mean, I walk that walk and the energy is like, that's why I don't do Wilmington. There's certain areas that still... They haven't rectified the problem with themselves. Oh, so you want me to come down for a surprise so you can give me another blow or another whelp? No. I'm good. Once you've been through hell enough times to know that you have nothing there, you don't go back there for surprises or anything. Why? Beware. Yeah. They get it. Uh, Every Jones ain't a Jones. And sometimes we are. Who is the alien superstar in this town? <laughs> I'm holding back, mother. I'm being nice today. See, I'm pulling back in every way. I could slay people so brilliantly today. So easily, too. Don't make them scared of you. Why? You wanted me to be scared of you. It's not fun when the rabbit's got the gun, is it? But I'm like Babs Bunny. You know, so I try, I try, I at least I try to be funny. <laughs> but I'm still Babs, you know what I'm saying? I'm still Babs. Or, uh, and, uh, Maniac, I'm Dot. <laughs> I'm Dot Water all day long. I am Dot Water. That, you know, that, that. That that cartoon with Dot and the devil. I am the big old house above. And Dot and I am Princess Touch. Set your ass down, bitch. You know, I'm like that type of whatever I be. Alchemist. I'm that type of alchemist. I'm not a bad witch. No. 
only bad only bad witches are ugly and they some some of these bad witches look pretty they look like models so they think they're doing their mind but they're ugly inside and out every time they do ugly shit liability 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 no productivity in that negativity but that's what you chose i told you once before you can't trust your bag to a hoe <laughs> i mean what part of bad don't you know clearly good math and that's why you blunt class and got left back so anyway that's all i had to say today because i'm talking to my military brace and we're kind of getting like yeah these people are crazy it's not you it's not you so i have to give this is a random shout out but you know it, but yet it's, it's true i have to shout out to you know when you're on point we have had our arguments we have had lord knows we have had our like We've gone up against each other. Like, like you know, we've had a, but but we have come to the means of the mind. And I will say on some things, it's really not lying. I mean, right now, I'm on point with some of the things that the Leo King says. If you know who he is, and you know, you, you know. You know, and down to like the mixing and stuff like that, I give credit because I've always been about music, yo, and putting ideas and thoughts into my music. I have to like refer to, I've always done that all my life. But when I'm seeing somebody else do it, I'm like, okay, so I'm not crazy. So this, there are other people like me. So I, I agree and some other things. There are some things that we don't always agree because, you know, he's a different, he's, he's from a, he's different family, different family. And yet we're still the same family. That's the thing that you don't see. People who can argue and still come together on a commonality. Like, yeah, they have really messed it up for the good ones. So not everything is sus. Who's doing your astrology chart? You better research that sucker. You better research him or her. All you people waiting to get your charts back, waiting to get your charts back, you keep giving money, you're not going to get that back. Faith in our works is dead. But they say, keep liking, keep subscribing, keep sharing, and I'm going to get him back. I'm going to get him. And stop DMing me and stop telling me. They ain't going to give you that back. If they would have given you that back, they would have given, given it back to you by now. They can't give it to you back. Liability. They don't understand productivity. They don't understand the really worker energy that faith without works are dead. They understand the talk, but they don't understand the walk. That's why the Christ consciousness walk is a walk. It's not about Jesus. Because Jesus, even in your book, that was, that, was, that was put together by that gay-ass king. But it don't matter. Clearly it does. That's why all women almost in the Bible are, are you know, almost painted like whores or something. Something wrong with him. Always a man got. To come. I mean, you know, like Elijah and Elijah. You still think that that were two? That was two men. My hubby and I figured that out. Oh, I got coffee. I got my stomach's hungry. Michael, like you started to eat coffee. We we're going to eat pancakes, and now you up here giving a class. Can we like eat? Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming back. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Elijah and Elijah. That's another story for you to. Uh, uh, and, okay, you don't have to play it my way, but just think for a moment. Just think for a moment if Elijah and Elisha, if that was a man and a woman. If that was a mentor and a mentee. Now, what would you The fact that that glitched like that, I'm on the right track. Are you? Happy hump day. We'll see y'all winning. Have a good day. Be good on purpose. Be kind on purpose. Be you on purpose. Embrace all of you on purpose. Learn to meet people on purpose. Not to steal from people on purpose. But to really find out about diversity. Find out about what a person really needs. Find out about some history and history other than what you were taught. Critical theory thinking and teaching. It's putting into action what you preach. Can you? Then what exactly do you teach? Not me. Not me. Anyway, what would Jesus do? What would Eleanor do? What would a real Christ conscious light worker working through the valley of the shadow of death do. Be careful who you choose as heroes and sheroes.
they could be a hundred times worse than you. Negativity, 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 liability, no productivity. If a system is failing, are they going to hang on to the liabilities? Or are they going to build with those who are really about productivity, real productivity? It's in the inside. You got to walk that walk on the inside first. And I see and feel and hear energies. I really do. So if I'm shying away from you, be glad. It's not me. Have a good day. Really. Honestly, I wish you really would. Learn something new. That's it. Flavor and Favor. It's the Ranger Manger Show. I am Val Jones, Cell School Cafe. Uh, you know, I put all the times and everything. So, you know. We're celebrating Black Music Month. Because someone's got to. Someone's got to take our history and our history back and put that in front of you. Without the masks of the clown. Hey. You know. Uh, I'm proud to be a strong, black, heterosexual woman. Who's a tomboy and a military brat. Who has locks and don't choose to dye my hair. Or have everybody up in my hair. Don't choose to do what everybody else is doing. Don't want to be a clone of many. I want to be individual, but yet I serve everyone. Good food. Good water. Good music. That's what I do. Am I lying? Where am I lying? Where am I lying? Where am I lying? Where am I lying to you? Where am I lying? Tell me. Show me where. Show me where I'm lying at any of that. Go ahead. Drop a receipt on where I'm lying at any of that. Then if you can't, what's your problem with that? Well, what I do? See, I told you. That problem is you. And intelligence recognizes intelligence. You ain't got nothing else to say. Speak for yourself. Dismiss. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. No, I'm not sorry. For Class dismissed.